Lots to talk about this offseason in college volleyball. I'm McKella Chester with the biggest impact transfers so far. Let's start with two big time transfers heading to Wisconsin. Middle blocker Carter Booth from Minnesota. Outside hitter Temi Thomas Ilara from Northwestern. Booth finished a stellar first season at Minnesota, leading the Gophers with a 1.48 blocks per set. And Thomas Ilara, a huge pickup on the outside after leading the entire Big Ten with 502 kills and a second best 4.33 kills per set. Kentucky and Florida have been dominating the SEC for a few years, but watch out for LSU and Tennessee now. The Tigers picked up former Badger national champion in Jay Demps, and Tennessee picked up star hitter from Ohio State, Janacea Moore. The Louisville Cards may be losing Claire Chasse to graduation, but the national runner-ups welcome Charity Looper, UCLA's leading scorer from last season. Oregon picked up two big time transfers to load up their roster. This team made a deep tournament run last year with the national freshman of the year, Mimi Collier and Brooke Nunnaviller, who they lost to graduation. Now they will bring in Kara McGee in the middle from Baylor, who ranked in the top 10 nationally in blocks per set and Gabby Gonzalez on the outside, Ohio State's leading scorer from last season. Jenna Wenis has transferred from Minnesota to Texas. The 6'1 junior outside from Frisco, Texas was second Second in kills for the Gophers and racked up 62 total blocks. She returns to her home state to play for the reigning national champs to help replace national player of the year, Logan Eggleston. Nebraska picked up Merrick Beeson from Florida. Beeson helped the Gators win a share of the SEC title with 3.35 kills per set as just a sophomore. And Annie Evans left Nebraska and will play her senior season at San Diego. This is big news for the Toreros after losing star setter Gabby Blossom. Next up, we've got Kylie Murr, Ohio State standout libero. She'll spend her last season of eligibility at Minnesota. Makes perfect sense following the loss of CeCe McGraw. Lastly, let's take a look at Penn State. The Nittany Lions totally revamped their lineup out of the transfer portal with three key pickups. One of the best setters in the nation, Mac Pedraza, will spend her last season at Penn State after a decorated career at Ohio State. She led the country in assists per set in the regular season. On top of Pedraza, PSU added Jess Merzik, the outside hitter from Michigan who averaged 4.19 points per set last season and will now have one of the best setters in the nation dishing the ball out to her. Plus, Lena Perugini, a libero from Coastal Carolina, and a few others transferred in as well. PSU loaded up. There are a ton more transfers listed out on NCAA.com, but those are my biggest impact transfers. Get ready for a great 2023 season.